Anthony Gill taking part in a little pregame warm-ups here with Virginia assistant coach Richie McKay. Gill, of course, sitting out a year as a transfer from South Carolina. He'll be eligible next year. He's been taking a lot of threes in this little workout with McKay. Obviously a little nervous with Whitey 365 filming, affecting his performance here. Man, Anthony. One of 15 from three-point range by yeah, my... I'm really not sure why they're putting through the drill, but maybe that's something they're trying to add to the game. And here I am joined with Brad Franklin of Cavs Corner from Rivals. Did I say it right? Yeah, you got it. There you we go. It. He'll be offering some color analysis during this Anthony Gill workout. Well, the one thing you can see from the way the Gill moves is how fluid he is. Even there on that little stop, uh, you, see it, you can kind of see the uh, potential that he has. One of the things I think fans are going to be really excited about when they see him play is that he's going to remind you at times of Mike Scott, but at other times he's going to remind you of a, of a bigger guy, even though he might not necessarily be a bigger guy, if that makes any sense. Yeah, Tony says he's a guy who loves contact, whereas Mike Scott didn't really thrive off that contact quite as much more of a finesse player. If you, if you watch old clips of, and I'm not comparing him to Akeem Olajuwon, but Olajuwon was that way in a lot of ways where he would get you so used to him making contact and then he float away from you so effortlessly. That's a, I think that's a little bit of an element that Anthony's going to bring next year. Well, Brad Franklin, thank you for joining us here on YD365. A surprise guest uh, appearance by you. Yeah, well, now that you're paying good, I'll, I'll show up more often. Sounds good.